Have you seen the smile on me face for a long time? No, you have not. Newcastle United have just beaten West Ham 1-0 in the Asia Trophy uh, third place game. And we haven't finished bottom. Uh, you can see all the... I've got the stream on still. All the people uh, who went to China and Newcastle fans from China. Great support throughout the two games. But a massive up to Yoshinori Muto. The goal was great and... He was superb, in my opinion. I thought he could be that man who takes us to the next spot next season, but we'll have to wait and see. We'll go over the game. We scored three goals, only one counted, but yeah, it's a bit positive. And Steve Bruce wasn't in the dugout, but a massive, massive thanks for the time over in China helping the squad before Steve Bruce came in as to Neil Redfern and Ben Dawson. A big up to them, they've done fantastic training the players, but great game, great game of football. It wasn't just shit and whatever. We actually played good, we defended really good. It just shows from the last game against Bulls, we had Shaw playing, Devab got playing. Uh, Tomlinson should have scored in the first half, to be fair, but we've done really well. I'm proud of the lads, and yeah, smile on my face. and. This time next week we've got Preston North End. It got confirmed by the club and that game will be next Saturday at 3 o'clock. You'll see previews in the video out then for it. But a massive smile on my face for once. It's mad to think. Oh, I'm really, really happy obviously. But we need to go forward. Right, we've put a bar now. Now we need to build off that bar. We've beaten West Ham who have spent, I know he wasn't playing, but £45 million on a striker. Don't know how much that Pablo, whatever he's called is, uh, they've signed some, they've signed players. We've signed nobody. We've, our squad went down and we lost to West Ham both times last season. Really happy, really proud of the lads and I thought everyone was great in the first half. First half, Martin Devabga, he's absolutely class. The, I'm not, I'm not going to do player rating, I'll just see how I think they've done. Uh, right back was Jamie Stevey. What a ball in for Muto, he... If he plays like that, he could become our right back for the next. Well, if we didn't sign a right back, he could be our right back for next season. That's if he went up from that next level, and that's what we need. Clark was all right. He did give away a handball, which, in my opinion, was a penalty. But I'm gonna not complain, am I? Shaw was class. Lascelles made a massive big tackle at the end when they had a tack. Had an attack with like one minute left. Great stuff by Lascelles. I said in the Wolves game that he shouldn't be played and now he's done really good. Left back. Who was left back? It was Richie. Yeah, Richie done all right. Three centre mids. So it's a 5-3-2 rather than a 5-2-3 or 5-4-1 or whatever. We had Hayden, Colbert and Shelby. And from, I thought they played all, all good. I thought Colbert was all right. <laughs> Hayden uh, was okay but... He did come off uh, he did have that little bit of an injury. Shelby was good. And then it was Sonnenson who should have got that goal. And then Muto, for me, was man of the match. He, his hold-up play, for a little lad like him, his hold-up play is fantastic. The way he can hold the ball up and actually use it is class. And for that game against uh, Wolves, he didn't have someone next to him. But since he can, they can build off each other... Uh, him and Sons, like obviously Sons and played it, they could pass the ball to each other and then do little one two. There was a time where Muto got the ball, he played it off the Sons and Sons and just had a little ball through. It's, it's just simple stuff like that. And yeah, I was really proud of the lads, really happy. That's going to be the end of the video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new. We'll go up, uh, we didn't finish bottom, we didn't finish bloody bottom, man. We're the bloody marks. <laughs> We're going to win the league. Stevie Bruce's blow-wide army. See you in the next one, lads. How are the lads?